Hello, guys and girls. It is I, Aaron Halo uh, 18 here. Uh, today, and I'm doing a YouTube video about uh, this week. I also went to church on Monday at the Young Adult uh, Ministry on uh, at Monday night at 6:30 or 7. And then it ended at the same time, 9:30. Uh, that is. And, uh, I said that, that I had a great time at uh, Young Adult Ministry at Mission Vale Christian Church. They did, uh, they did prayer group. They do prayer groups uh, before they start the sermon or their worship music. Uh, and, uh, they do, like, little prayer requests and stuff about their lives and stuff, things in their life. And, uh, and uh, I was in a prayer group with uh, my friend uh, Brad uh, Ringett and uh, uh, Grant, uh, two friends of mine from uh, there, uh, actually. And uh, this Monday was, it was an all... Uh, just worship music uh, at uh, ETC, I guess they call it ETC, and uh, and before I left, I said goodbye to three people there uh, from the church. Uh, uh, Haley was uh, there, and she said goodbye to me, and uh, stuff. So there weren't a whole lot of people there uh, Monday night, and uh, and uh, and uh, nobody came over this Tuesday. Uh, or, or or anything, but I had a Bible study yesterday with uh, my friend uh, Tommy King and Wyatt Motisa and uh, Stephen Friendo were here. They had a lot of theological conversations and, and stuff. They they were laughing and joking around with each other. They read the website called the Babylon B uh, uh, website and. Uh, it was a really good uh, uh, Bible study last night, and we did uh, the last uh, chapter of First uh, Peter, um, chapter five, I believe, and uh, we, we discussed some of it. And then they, they talked about other uh, biblical things and stuff. And yeah, I mentioned about Joe Austin uh, too uh, uh, last night as, as well. Uh, I guess uh, why I didn't like him either. The guy's just too... He does it for money. That's all Joe Austin does it for. I'm not a fan of him. And I, I think he's a phone eater fraud. And also they were talking about how evil the Catholic Church uh, was too at uh, Bible study. I guess and they start... And they, and, uh, they start with prayer. And, and then we do, after Bible study, prayer re requests. Before they left and we did it. Tommy uh, prayed it all, all, for, all for all of us about uh, our prayer request and stuff. And uh, they were talking about the different religions that people believe in and stuff. And they were mentioning about some of their friends too. But uh, I'm not gonna. Uh, what about they mentioned Buddhism, Catholicism. Uh, Wyatt and Steve are very into theological uh, uh, stuff about uh, biblical things. And uh, they were talking about their favorite pastors and stuff. And that was a pretty good boss. They're they really great guys. and They love the Lord with all their heart. and They're strong believers in Christ and Christian. So just, just like me. Uh, I'm a Christian uh, as well. And I, I just wanted to share the week with my, uh, this is my, uh, it'll be part seven. It's called Christian Vlog Part Seven, uh, I guess. It's a little series of, uh, uh, Christian articles and, and stuff. And yeah, uh, and that Bible study was really good, and it's, it's fun to have Bible studies and hear other people's thoughts of 
the world uh, and stuff and a biblical and Christian uh, perspective uh, and uh and yeah like like everybody else in this world uh, they enjoy video games movies uh, all, all, all sorts of entertainment stuff too but that's not really that important Christianity is, is, is important to me I just wanted to share all these videos and please don't unsubscribe uh, to my channel because I'm doing Christian videos uh, I want uh, please give me more subscribers don't leave my channel up. I'm sorry I'm not very good at uh, videos and stuff I don't have all that fancy uh, stuff in my videos so I hope you don't mind I just do like vlog talking uh, and stuff and I was gonna read some something from uh, uh, First Peter uh, I guess It's the last chapter of First Peter. Uh, and First Peter uh, chapter 5 says, uh, Shepherd the flock of God, do I exhort the elders among you as a fellow elder and a witness of the sufferings of Christ, as well as a, a partaker in the glory that is going to be revealed. Shepherd the flock of God that is among you, exercising oversight, not under compulsion, but will willingly, as God would have, have you, not for shameful gain, but eagerly not domineering uh, over those in your charge but being examples to the flock to the flock when the chief uh, shepherd uh, appears you will receive the unfading crown of glory likewise you who are younger to be subject to the elders clothe yourselves all of you with an humility toward one another. For God opposes the, the proud, but gives grace uh, to the humble. Humble yourselves, therefore, under the mighty hand of God, so that at the proper time he may exalt you, casting all your anxieties on him, because he cares uh, for you. Be sober-minded, be watchful, your advisory, the devil prowls around like a roaring uh, lion, seeking someone to devour. Resist him, firm in your faith, knowing that the same, same kinds of suffering are being experienced for your brotherhood throughout the world. After you have suffered a little while, the God of all grace, who has called you to his eternal glory in Christ, will himself restore, confirm, strengthen, and establish you. To him be the dominion uh, forever and ever. Amen. And yes, this is the ESV uh, version uh, of the Bible. It's also known as uh, English uh, Standard uh, Version is what it's called. And the last part of this chapter is uh, Final Greetings. And it says, By Silvinius, a faithful uh, brother, as I regard him. I have written, uh, written uh, briefly to you, exhorting and declaring, that this is the true grace of God. Stand firm in it. Stand firm in it. She who is at Babylon, who is like, likewise chosen, sends you greetings, and so does Mark. My son, 
greet one another with the kiss of love. Uh, peace to, to all of you who are in Christ. And I think the mark they're talking about here is uh, the mark from uh, John Ryan, John Mark uh, is actually. They were, they were also mentioning about how John, John Mark was, was kind of a coward and, and he ran away uh, from uh, Saul. Uh, I, I guess he was Barnabas. He was with Barnabas. And uh, the three of them split up. John Mark went with Barnabas and Paul went a different way. Uh, I, I guess. And uh, even though they were saying that uh, Peter is very encouraging uh, to the Christians uh, back then. And it's, it's encouraging to Christians today as uh, well, I, I believe. And uh, it's a pretty good uh, book. It's very powerful. The Word of God is very powerful, I think. It's very good and, and stuff. And it's very encouraging. And I hope you guys will learn from it. And understand what what they mean. You should probably uh, write the description. I mean, in the discussion. I mean, the comments down below and ask me to and uh, to teach me some things too. I want to hear what you, what you guys thought. What you, what you guys thought thoughts are on this Christianity, uh, the Bible, the, the one I the book that I just read, the chapter I just read today. I hope you learned something from it, and uh, tell me what you think about it. I want to hear it. I want to know. I'm sorry I'm not very good at de describing uh, biblical things, but I try my best, uh, I guess. Sorry, uh, uh, I mean, I did a video last week. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm still doing videos. Don't unsubscribe. Just be patient. And uh, I'll bring you more uh, content and stuff. And uh, yeah, I saw that new cowboy movie uh, recently. With my f good friend, uh, Steven Frendel. I I'm going to do a review later for that uh, uh, movie, I guess. I, gu I, gu I guess I gave that movie a 9 out of 10. And... Uh, I try to get out of the community as, as much as I can and, and stuff, even though I have, like, breathing issues and stuff. I, I do a lot of coughing lately, and I, I, I woke up 3 o'clock uh, in the morning doing treatments for an hour from 3 to 4 uh, uh, this morning. Uh, and my dad was a little tired, uh, and uh, I, I should uh, please pray for me to uh, stop coughing uh, uh, that early in the morning. And uh, for my breathing to do better, and for everything to do well, but better. Pray for me to not be so lonely, and alone, have feelings of being lonely, or depressed. Please pray about that for me too. And please pray for all, all of my uncles, everybody I love and care for. Whatever problems are medical or or wherever they have, whatever issues it is. And uh, also pray for me to not cost them as much. For me to continue going to a Monday night uh, thing, and uh, also going to a Thursday night uh, tonight, uh, actually at CM, at the Santa Barbara Church. That's around like 7 o'clock or so. And I'm also in a life group. And uh, there was a group of guys. Um, uh, uh, Todd, uh, Tommy King is one of them, and uh, Wyatt is another. Uh, they they both go. And uh, I really do enjoy the life groups. I guess. And it's uh, fun. And you know, some of them are not very friendly or anything. Uh, one of them is a texter. And, And, but please pray for the guys in my life group uh, as well. And please uh, pray for all my uh, friends too. And everybody in this uh, world uh, stay away from the drugs and the alcohol 
that stuff is not good. And they're smoking that as well. For people to stop doing that too. And for people to not do them uh, anymore. And uh, also pray for me to sleep well at night and dream good dreams and for God's will to be done in my life. And for me to uh, 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 pray for me to have a girlfriend that I can uh, kiss and hold hands and uh, read the Bible with and, and pray with and do all Christian things with and, and, and stuff and, uh, and for it to be uh, beautiful uh, on the inside and out. And, and uh, yeah. And for, for her to have the uh, same interest and in, uh, help me with uh, things and stuff. To help me play uh, video games and stuff. Uh, uh, and uh, hopefully, uh, I really, this Veronica girl uh, I met, to be, for her to be my friend and come, come, come over and hang out and uh, talk to me and see me and pay me a visit uh, one of these days. And uh, I just want to be friends uh, for now, uh, is all. And uh, I even go on, I mostly spend a lot of time on YouTube and uh, Facebook uh, as well. Just keep me in your prayers and uh, and for God's will to be done in everything in my life, uh, actually. And for me to continue bringing these awesome Christian videos for you guys uh, to hear. And please pray for me to do well, for me to have good days when I go to a church on Mondays and Thursdays. But uh, and, uh, next week, they're not. They're skipping a week for Monday, I guess. I don't know why or anything, or I don't know why or, or anything. I think it has something to do with the pastor. I guess that's what Haley said. I guess. And uh, yeah, my friend Haley knows uh, Tommy King. They went to high school uh, together. And uh, yeah. And uh. I really have to, uh, I hope you enjoyed listening to my, uh, talk about Christianity, and, uh, and, uh, make sure you check out that Babylon B, uh, website, and, uh, I think Babylon is spelled, uh, B-A, uh, B-Y-L-O-N, and, uh, B-E-E, -E, as in the insect, uh, B, it's called the Babylon Bee. It's a website of Christian ar articles and stuff. And all the things in the world. And, and kind of hilarious. Uh, comical uh, a little bit too. And uh, I guess Stephen laughs at, at, at it, I guess. I, I don't know. I've never read the website really. but And uh, he's kind of against uh, uh, Bill Nye, the science guy, I guess. Because Bill Nye is kind of an atheist. And uh, stuff like that. And they have uh, debates, and Stephen likes all that uh, theological uh, stuff. It's I'm not really good. At, I'm not really into that kind of stuff. But it's very interesting uh, to hear them talk about. It, uh, I guess, and uh, I just wanted to share uh, things about uh, what I did uh, during the weekend and over the rest of my weekend. And uh, I'm getting a new uh, wheelchair uh, tomorrow. It's got like a reclined feature and stuff. I, I hope I like it. I'm a little nervous about it and stuff. Pray for the whole wheelchair, new wheelchair thing. And for tomorrow to go well uh, uh, for me as well. And it's uh, very exciting to get new stuff. I think I always get nervous when I get new stuff. I don't know why. Just uh, kind of weird to me. Uh, and... Uh, I just wanted to show that, I guess. I can probably share a lot of stuff uh, with you, but uh, I gotta, I gotta go uh, here shortly. So I'll be able. To, well, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys and girls. And please rate, comment, like, favorite, subscribe. Thoughts, 
and opinions, and I hope you like it. And enjoy it for your good pleasure, guys and girls. And stay tuned for more. And like Ghost Rose says, please drink some hot chocolate. And I'll see you all later. And this is Aaron Halo 18. Signing off. And my favorite verse, is, as always, is John 360. I, I, I don't know. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. Whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. That is one of my favorite quotes from the Bible. And, uh, and also the ghost, robot, the ghost robot thing I said is my favorite quote as well. And uh, like always, this is Aaron Halo 18 signing off. Goodbye.